You talked about them a bit post game. Uh, the- Tuck and Thompson, what have you liked about their game lately that's led to some of the zone time they've had? Uh, Tuck has been uh, incredible, uh, up and down and uh, all over the rink. Reed plays very well, positioning very well for pucks to come back to him. Uh, Tom has worked hard. He's been physical where he needs to be and, and shooting more and uh, looks a lot more like himself. So, you know, those two in combination uh, are pretty, pretty explosive when they're on. What's the key to turning the page, but also absorbing the lessons that you guys took away from, from Edmonton? Uh, you you know, in this league, you got to turn the page and turn it fast. But obviously, we reviewed film in areas that uh, we didn't like, areas that uh, we targeted we could be sharper in. And uh, you move into tonight's game, um, you know, after that. What's the challenge when, especially if you're down a goal, third period, that sort of situation, to get younger forwards to be detailed defensively coming back into their zone? What is the challenge there? Yeah, it's just what you said. It's a challenge. It's yeah. a challenge for, uh, you know, for, for, for the even older players to stay focused and dialed in and not frustrated at times. Um, but, yes, younger players, um, you know, it's uh, obviously the previous levels, they, they, before you enter the NHL, it's only the guys that dominate uh, those levels that get to the NHL. And you don't recognize your vulnerabilities until you get here. And, um, you know, that's uh, just another, another challenge of, of playing at this level. In hindsight, the last two and a half weeks, what's it meant to have Zemgis around the group and just the example that he sets in practice, skates, and even off the ice as you guys prepare in between games? Yeah, Zemgis is, is uh, incredible. Obviously, he, he um, uh, has a deep love and passion for the Sabres and the Sabre organization. Um, he's put in so much work over the years. Everything matters to him, everything. And uh, you mentioned the details. He... he, he you know, he was a guy who entered the league young and had to learn a lot. And uh, you, you see a very experienced guy as a result. Uh, Bo Byram, our first look at him as a saver. What have you noticed about him, uh, early observations and maybe the pairing? Yeah, a talent. I mean, talent uh, combined with compete. Uh, he fits in well with our group. Obviously, we, we have a very young team um, and a team that, uh, you know, is, is experiencing lots of things for the first time. Uh, and you know he brings some experience, obviously from from Colorado, some big experience of a Stanley Cup. But at the end of the day, you think of how young Owen Power is, and you look at how many games played Owen Power has in the NHL and Bo, and it's it's within two or three of each other. It's it's so it's amazing, uh, you know how young these guys are. But uh, uh, very talented, and I think he he rounds out that defensive, a very young defensive group, very well. Do you expect Jost to be able to go tonight? Jost will not, so that puts Robinson in. It'll shift uh, lines around a little bit. Uh, Zemgis will uh, probably shift back to center for us.